Hi everybody, I wanted to do a quick video on testing your internet speed or your broadband connection speed. There's lots of videos out there, but I wanted to show you how I tested mine, but also to understand why uh, doing internet speeds uh, matter. So I think you should do it for a number of reasons. There's uh, obviously the quality of the experience. So whether you're streaming or working remotely, gaming, if you've got a slow internet connection, that can be a real pain in the backside. So uh, speed tests can help you gauge whether or not uh, your connection speeds actually meet the demands that you have uh, on your uh, internet speed. It's also great for troubleshooting. So if you're experiencing some slow browsing or it's laggy, then uh, an internet speed test can help you identify whether whether the issues lie within uh, your internet connection or whether it's something else. So it helps you do a bit of investigation. Also, just choosing the right plan. So ISPs, uh, broadband providers offer lots of different plans uh, with different speed tiers. So if you conduct regular speed tests, it can help you ensure you're getting the speed test that you're paying for. I think that's the most probably the most important one and uh, monitoring performance. So, you know, with a speed test, you can monitor your internet connections performance, but you can do it over time. So this is uh, particularly useful if you're identifying any variations or uh, declines in speed. And probably, you know, there's improving connectivity. So if you're doing speed tests and the speed test results show you're getting a bit of a subpar performance, then you can take steps to to optimize that. So you can fiddle around with router settings or if that fails, you can contact your ISP uh, to find out what's going on. So <clears throat> there are three sites that I really use for doing speed tests. I don't just rely on one. I think it's good to do at least two and three is ideal. So the first one that I use is uh, ovh.net. So if I just run the test quickly on there. So at the bottom, it shows you the country it's connecting to uh, to do the test. Um, first one it does is a download test. So uh, this is on an Ethernet connection. I've got a one gig service uh, from BT or 930, I think, is the published rate. So if you saw there, I got to the 930 that they uh, that they uh, advertise. It also does an upload test. So I know I get 110 uh, megabits per second with BT. So you can see I'm definitely getting that. And then it does a latency test uh, after that. So I just let it run through and do the latency test. So six, um, six or so milliseconds, I think, which is great. Once that's done, if you want to, you can hit the share icon and you can share those uh, results elsewhere. Uh, another one that I use, uh, let's just close that off. Another one I use is one that's done by Netflix. So if you go to fast.com, Netflix have their own uh, speed test server. So as I said, I'm on a one gig service, so I'm getting one gig, 990. Um, there's also uh, an info button. If you click on that, it'll also show you the other features like your upload speed test um, and latency, etc. And then the third one I use, let's just go back is probably <coughs> one of the most famous ones, which is uh, Speed Test uh, by Ookla. So again, just press go in the middle and away that goes. These ones do collect a lot of data because they feed this into um, speed test results that you that are published all around the world. So you can see how your speed compares uh, to others in your country. So again, I've gone straight up to 920, 930. So, and the line across the top shows you the stability of the connection, which is probably just as important as the speed. So they're the three providers that I use. As I say, I think it's a really good idea to use more than one. Two's fine, but I think three's better. So you can see I've tested three, di three times the service, three different speed test providers and I'm getting what I paid for. So I think that's probably the most important reason that I do this. I want to make sure uh, I'm getting what I pay for, and if not, I'll be straight onto the ISP uh, putting my complaints in. Anyway, I hope that helps. If it does, please consider subscribing. It really helps us out, and maybe even uh, hitting that notification bell so we see each other in the next video. Take care, everyone.